Defense wins games is one of those mantras that I've heard commonly applied to strategy and squad. And let's be clear, strategy is very important for a successful game of squad, even more so than the sexy tactics we love to talk about here. In my last gameplay video, I talked about how kills are very important for a team to win in squad. Still, I also emphasized how kill count can be a misleading metric for an individual player's contribution to the team due to the role that teamwork plays in achieving said kills. And in last week's video, we talked about how tactics can be used to win firefights. But as the great Sun Tzu is credited as having said in The Art of War, strategy without tactics is the slow route to victory. Tactics without strategy is the noise before the defeat. Now Sun Tzu didn't actually say that, it's actually a misconception that that quote is from The Art of War. But the wisdom that it conveys is so good that it might as well be. And that's what I want to talk about today. We're going to continue our ongoing discussion of what factors are important for winning a match of squad, but zoom out a little bit to look at the big picture. So tell me how many times have you experienced the following? You're kicking ass in the game, you're getting a lot of kills, and your squad is succeeding at seemingly everything that it sets out to accomplish. And maybe even your team looks like it's on the verge of executing a perfectly coordinated offensive. And then somehow, the tables flip in an instant, and suddenly your team is on a one-way path to defeat, being rolled all the way back to your first objective. How can this happen? Well. This experience usually happens when you get too focused into your immediate surroundings. It's too easy in squad to become tunnel visioned on the exciting firefight that you're currently engaged in, and lose yourself in the need to succeed in the immediate task before you. But little do you know that you're actually missing what's happening in the bigger picture beyond your own little world. And that the reality is that you're fighting an inconsequential firefight while the rest of your team desperately needs your help somewhere else on the map. It's not rare for squads to do this. After all, no squad leader is perfect and no player is either. But what is, in my opinion, unforgivable is how often this phenomenon leads to the neglect of one of the most important components of a successful squad strategy, a strong defense. So let's go back to the mantra I shared at the beginning of the video, defense wins games. Now, it doesn't literally mean that defense is all you need to win a match of squad. Rather, it means that in most games of Assault and Secure, given that both teams are conducting pretty effective attacks, the team that has the more successful defense is likely to win. On the flip side, the team that neglects its defense will often experience a sudden and catastrophic collapse where not just one objective is lost, but a domino effect occurs where multiple objectives fall in quick succession. This also leads to the loss of hundreds of tickets before the team is finally able to redeploy to stop the enemy advance. So how do we make sure that the team maintains a diligent strategy that doesn't neglect the defense? Well, for one, it requires good communication between the different squad leaders on the command chat. But more importantly, it requires the squad leaders to be willing to volunteer for the task when it's necessary. I've noticed that players often turn up their noses at defense because it's perceived as a boring job that doesn't get as much action. Now granted, it is more passive than actively seeking out the enemy to attack and take their habs, radios, and objectives, but I really never understood this position. If you're on the defense, it's almost guaranteed that the enemy will attack and try to take your defense objective at some point, which means that you will get plenty of action throughout the game and plenty of opportunities to attack and destroy enemy habs and radios. Not to mention that fighting a solid defensive action can be one of the most fun, fulfilling experiences that you can have in squad. Think about it. It's part of the reason why people love super fob so much, despite how controversial they are. Honestly, for a community so obsessed with super fobbing, it's surprising how much it hates defending. But here's another thing. One squad shouldn't be shouldering the burden of defense the entire game by itself. If we assume that a team has four full infantry squads, one squad should be kept on the defense while the other three attack. Now sometimes this can shift to two and two, or even the entire team falling back to defend depending on the ebb and flow of the game. But the general expectation is that there are those squads on defense and those squads on attack. When an objective is captured, whether your attack squads successfully took the enemy point, 
or the enemy took your defense point, the squads should conduct a leapfrog maneuver between the objectives and rotate their roles. So for example, if your squad was on defense and your team managed to capture the enemy point, those squads that were just on the attack would hold their position at the newly captured point while your own squad and any others that were on defense would advance past them to the next objective to set up new habs, radios, and begin a new attack. This also has the advantage that a squad that was just on the attack is likely going to need some time to get their casualties respawned in, to resupply spent ammo, and to reorganize any scattered squad mates. So leapfrogging gives those squads some breathing room to conduct all those things without having to worry about immediately moving on towards the next objective. Now similarly, if your squad was on defense but lost the point to an enemy attack, you would continue to keep fighting where you've been fighting to try and retake the point, while the previously attacking squads on your team that are now out of position would quickly either respawn or fall back to cover the new defense point to your rear. This is what a good flow of squads ideally looks like in a well-coordinated team. And to be honest, a team that diligently manages its strategic coordination but maybe isn't as skilled individually will more than likely be able to defeat a team composed of uber FPS gamers that have poor team level strategy. This is because as much as kills are needed in squad for clearing and capturing points or for draining enemy tickets, the ticket swings that come from objective captures and radio kills can be far more decisive. For example, in Advance and Secure, capturing an enemy objective will gain your team 60 tickets and lose the enemy team 10 tickets for a net gain of 70. In Invasion, a point capture leads to a gain of 100 tickets. So welcome to Goose Bay, where I joined the 1st Canadian Mechanized Brigade Group, a combined arms unit, to take on the PLA's 14th Amphibious Combined Arms Brigade. On paper, this was a pretty evenly matched game. Both sides were playing as combined arms units, so there was no asymmetric advantage in armor or spawns that one side enjoyed over the other. But it wasn't long before the enemy team had a major advantage over ours due to a major strategy blunder made by our team. We neglected our defense objective at naval refueling station and it wasn't long before it was being captured by the enemy. As a result, we were forced to conduct attacks on two points, both our defense point at naval refueling station and our attack point at hilltop redoubt when we had the same resources as the enemy team, instead of just defending one while attacking the other. This put us at a major disadvantage due to the difficulties of coordinating effective attacks, and the inherent advantage that exists with being on the defense. Now this was a game full of cool moments and kills, but it also served as an abject lesson on the importance of strategic coordination for success in squad. As you watch today's gameplay, I challenge you to keep an eye out for what our team might have done wrong, why that might have occurred, and also to think about whether we were able to make the right adjustments in response to our mistakes. Alright guys, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to capture, I believe this is going to be a seven point map, so we're going to try to capture a second point, and then leapfrog to get an attacking hab on fourth point, or defending, depending on how it goes. Alright, we lost our lav to the southeast. Yep, so when we get out, I want Charlie to get to the east side of point, and uh, wait just in case that, uh, that armor comes in. Copy that. I'll tell you if I see anything. Enemy armor to our east, marked and reported. Of course this kid doesn't get fucking binos. Okay, I'm looking east, can't see much though. That sounds like a tank to the southeast. Yeah, we'll have to be uh, careful when we leave. Objective secured. I say again, objective secured. Okay, it's going secured. to hilltop. I'm falling back to the bridge. Here's, yeah, here's what we're going to do. Um, here, let me drive. We're going to go way north. Oh, I don't like this open field, bro. What's your fucking punch Clean. always by? You don't speak that shit into existence, bro. Alright, everyone out, everyone out, everyone out. Okay. If it's a better one than what I have. Are you not... Are you? Move up to move, Mark. I'm gonna move along with you with the Lodgy once you guys get a little bit ahead of me. Alright, go on to move. Clear it out. We're gonna get a radio down. The 
Objective has been locked down. Oh, just come over here and take this. Oh, we got a nice little north-south pincer uh, set up on hilltop. Yes, I need you here with, with us quick. Yeah, I'm moving. I'm moving across. Yep, 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 yep. APC on me, APC on me. There's an APC on me, I just dropped a hat. Kilo's hovering above me. Good hit on the Hilo tail rotor. Hilo is dead. Hey, Dance, did I get that Hilo's tail rotor? Yeah, you did. That was a perfect hit, man. I got a really good view of it from underneath. There's an APC that bugged out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right in the street line. Rally's going down here shortly, guys. Yeah, my fucking PLA combo is doing them real nice shit, dude. Ready, ready on me, ready on me, man. There's still guy right. on my body. Right here, Infantry close south. Dance, radio right oh, here. On you? All right, bang around. Oh yeah, I got talking. it. I'll dig it. They're gonna be pushing you hard. They're gonna be pushing you hard. At least a few guys. I'm on the radio digging it right now. Yeah, 40 on spawn. 40 on spawn. Yeah, there's infantry south pushing in. So be careful. We're losing station, refueling station. We got nobody on defense. Yeah, unfortunately that's yeah. not. <sighs> Fuck. Get this radio down and then we'll fall back. We're gonna get pushed down all the way back to fishing village. Is that his EBL or whatever the fuck that thing's called, Dance? Heard. Hey, everyone in squad, move back to, to Lodgy. Is it wheeled or tracked with an auto cannon? He's, he, he's in charge, Charlie. Yeah, I think so. I'm looking at Charlie, I don't see anything. Yeah, last I saw, he drove into the uh, Dill and our Elo just got shot by the tank. Got you. I'm crossing the street with you. I'm spawning on Hab. I'm gonna jump in with you, we're gonna get a Hab down to the north. Be careful, last I knew there was a Vic going north. Copy. You just take Charlie and try to hunt it. That ZBL, where the fuck it is, going down the road here. Okay, is it coming towards us? That's a ZBL. I believe so. Hey, Red, you got left behind. Uh, Just uh, run. ZBL. Yeah, yeah, he's on the main road, Dance. Be ready. Alright. I'm waiting for him to pass me. Did you not want me to dig that radio down, Dan? I mean... You get a hit? Hey, what's with the hack hit? The squad ain't said they were gonna take care of it. You see, you know where I'm at? He's dead. Nice shot. Let's keep it moving, boys. That was a good one, two, three there. Damn. Yep. Friendlies west. There's still enemies in that building. Yep. I'm gonna wait to see if he tries to revive that other guy. Fucking pointless thinks I could help him with his fucking stuck in a vehicle tree bullshit. Do you see that shit? Headshot one. Look at what? Hang on, I, I missed that. Oh, there's another Watch one in the doorway. Command online. Another Vic coming in. Another tracked Vic. Yeah, it's too bad we're out of AT. I got a lot of shot left. Janitor, hold on the dig down. Come get me. Shot another. I'm gonna try to track him, Dance, when, if he peeks out. Okay, I don't have an AT. 
Oh, got That's another dude. I'll they just keep him. they just keep popping out of the doorway. Fuck. Just keep fucking them up, dude. Yep, I got him. They might be wiped now. That, that there's an Amy right here on Charlie. He's. Going oh, I upstairs. see him coming up. Squad lead. They're probably gonna go for a revive. I can't shoot him. Fuck. It's okay. It's okay. They're trapped in there. What's what's yeah. the Carl Gustav? High explosive. Is that anti infantry? Holy fuck. It, I think it's a heat round. Well, I have a, a high explosive anti tank round, and then I got two high explosives. Dropped another. Oh, really? Oh, they might be legit high explosives. Yeah, I'm gonna shoot one in that building then. Alright, they just. Yeah, just do it. They dragged one inside. Pop the smoke, too. Second floor, right? Second floor, yep. Where that smoke is, I think I just shot one through the through the wall. Not sure though. I'm changing mag. I got hit by a nade, but I shot my rocket. Okay. Oh shit! All right, that that whole squad is gonna come back alive though. I'm still. Oh, they're in the first floor now. I don't have the stability to make Are you shots. Guys able to move north Scrap free is coming up to the refueling Yep, station. I see There's movement. So much fucking, oh yeah. Let's push it. I need to cross the street, but I have no bandages and I'm bleeding. I'm dead too. They snuck up around us. Squad 3 is going in there. They're gonna get fucked uh, if they go in that fucking town. Yeah, they got a whole squad here. Oh, Everyone, we're gonna was... uh, rally up on one move. Copy that. Alright, guys, work off rally here. Let's make a uh, methodical move into naval refueling. Yeah, Jander, you got ammo in your bag, right? Cause I'm gonna need a hat right I'm gonna start regaining Stam. Right. Hey, our whole objective is right now... Spot. Copy, is we're gonna wait for Vox. We are supporting our AT, cause there's just too much armor to just push right in. We gotta support our AT, they're our priority. To finish off that MVP. Movement on the silo, movement on top of the silo. Uh, between 240 and 255. If you have a clear shot, take it. I see it's him. Too far, keyboard. He's prone. Drop your bag. Alright, go to move mark. I killed the guy. Yep, I killed him. Hey, yeah. Good shot. Good That's shot. a roll, dude. Hey, you, you gonna do that little cold little zoom in thing on your YouTube video so you can see what you're shooting at? Oh, uh, hell yeah. Well, yep, tanks hat. really close. Let's let our lights and hats. Oliver, try to track it. Yeah, probably still in the same fucking spot. Yeah, on the map, I just saw the helo die over the water to the west. Ship north, ship north, it saw us. Ship north. Alright, moving north. Where is he? He's for contacts now. I believe he's trapped, I'm not too sure. No, where the fuck is he? Oh. There he is. Dead, no one said where he was. No, it's okay. I'm coming to get you, Vox. Tank is accurately marked. Alrighty, here we go. Oh, this is gonna be tough. This is good, dude. When when you get up, I really hope you don't spaz out in that weird revive animation. Otherwise, we're fucked, dude. Oh, I'm going to. I'm going to, dude. Hey, I got foot shoulders okay. running right to me right now. You you better get ready to pop that Sorry, shot man. off. He's okay. Yeah, there he is. There's at least at least fire team size. At least fire team size coming from this up. I'm black why I Copy. Okay, he's he's two one three two one two. He's uh slightly rally behind burn, that tree. I'm dead. Hit. 
Just be careful. Oh, okay. We have a vehicle circling this area. Yeah, we're uh, we're looking to get rid of it. That's the goal. Yeah, he went south, so you'll find he him went there south? somewhere. Yeah. Uh, Blueberry's saying that the Vic went south. Alright, hey, we're gonna come in from a different angle, guys. Let's try to get to this tree line. On mark. Drop them. Ooh, I don't like crossing the open like this. Oh, fuck, they're shooting me at me. I see movement infantry northwest by that uh, cylinder here. looking thing by the pipes. What's up? Alright, where's the enemy thing? Infantry Sorry. contact 334 to the north. Dance, you good? Uh, I saw infantry northwest. Uh, northwest, nor north, northwest. Ah, oh, fuck, I'm gonna shut Give up. There we go. Yeah, check, check. <laughs> Bring this down. For one. Go here, go here. Hey, what's up guys? If you enjoyed that, go ahead and hit the like button, comment down below, and consider subscribing if you want more content like this. I hope you guys enjoyed, and thanks for watching.